Getting down from here is a bit of a problem, but you know what? It's not too much of a problem, provided the camera cooperates. Hi, I'm Game Guy. Uh, make note of what is under here. As I recall, well, there's music notes around, but you can't actually get under these platforms safely. Um, there's a there's a golden banjo. I'll grab that. I gotta revive my stock of lives. It's a, it's a very important thing. Will I make it back? Yes. Yes, I will. Can I actually, like, get underneath there if I tank a hit? I'm not actually sure. I mean, if I'm going for anything, it's gonna be the Jinjo, so... Ouchie pain! Uh, I tried to go under there. I don't think he, it worked, so I'm not gonna try it again. Mysterious and weird. Alright, well... Somewhere in the world is where we gotta go. You know what, big old turtle man? Let's go say hello to big old turtle man. How you doing, turtle man? Oh, my feet are numb and cold. That's weird. Let me help you out by causing you physical injury. Ah, that's a bit better. You said ouch when I hit you. You, you seem to maybe be in a bit of pain. Just... You know, for some reason, this is what you desire, I guess. I mean, I suppose, you said they were numb. I suppose, if you're feeling things, that's a good sign, right? Hmm, tank tub's warm at last. Somehow this warmed you up. You know, just physical injury is all it takes to make someone warm at heart. Uh, there's a cool pair of boots here. I'm probably gonna want to take advantage of. Do I need eggs. I mean, I needed an egg. I didn't need much from that, but you know what? I got it anyway. There's some feathers over there. Some more feathers over there. I'm gonna just go inside a turtle. Seemed like the thing to do. What's in here? This is what I desire to know. There are notes inside. Hello. The famous Tip Top Choir. Man, you're a lot bigger than last time I saw you. It's time to remember patterns, kids! <laughs> Bit short, isn't it? Tip Top doesn't even know who you are, Kazooie. Shut up. Uh, real quick, make sure you backflip onto his podium. I... D Listen, I d what? Why are you repeating it? I already know what your stupid code is. I want to jump on your stupid podium. Thanks. No, stop. Literally stop. No. Stop. Please. I'm begging you. I, j I just want to get the mumbo token also. Please. Please. I need you to cease and desist, friend. All right. All right. So, it's time to remember the password by beating up the choir. Get out of here, choir. No one even likes you. All right, I did it. Hmm, not too bad. Try listen to. If you say so. That's a pretty magical melody you got going on there. It's pretty magical, and eccentric, and cool, and great, and wonderful. The last one's the hard one, though. Ah, splendid. You just need one more lesson. So I do. Yeah. 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 Yeah! Will I remember this? The question is answered with a maybe, to be honest. I mean, I can I can just blatantly miss beating up this poor turtle. I can just say, I can do that. This is the song that doesn't include Yellow Turtle. No one even likes Yellow Turtle. He's a jerk. I did it! Magnificent! A true masterpiece! 
A trinket? I love trinkets! Yeah! Give to me the super gold thing so my bird can eat it and have digestive problems in the future. Finally. Just as nature intended. Where did the giant turtle go? I mean, he's here, but it doesn't... That's not what the inside of a turtle looks like. That's the inside of the shell, if anything. It's, it's weird. Video game, you're weird. Do I have anywhere else to go except for big alligator face over here? I think this is the only place left. So, uh, let's go to big ol' alligator face. It's... It's just kind of a big ol' alligator face. Don't get confused, kids. It's not even real. Can I use the waiting boots to get anything of note here? I'm just kind of looking around and I'm not really seeing a whole lot of anything. I'm gonna go check this little corner over here. It is suspect to me. There's nothing here but feathers. This game's pretty good about hiding stuff in places usually, but... Uh, in this case, there wasn't a whole lot to hide, it turns out. Croc this man, I need you to eat an egg. I believe that's over by where the turtle was, so I kind of did this a little bit out of order, but you know what, it's all right. It's fine, nothing has to be like the most efficient. I kinda want those, I think. It's probably a good thing to grab, because I used a bunch earlier to, to beat up some amphibians, as you do. Uh, there's another one over there that I must defeat. It is a requirement. Ah, there's notes over here in the pond. Uh, this might be an occasion where I use a gold feather, actually. All right, let's grab one and let's go! Run into the water, piranhas can't hurt me anymore. They can't, they won't. It's not a thing they can do. All right, well, there's that done. I'm oh no, I've taken fall damage for the first time by falling off of a water sausage. I, I don't know how I feel about that, but you know what? It's all right. It's all right. I could go jump in the water and gain a honeycomb and, and then immediately lose it because there's piranhas in the water. Uh, what am I at stat-wise here? You can view your totals, by the way. I got 6 out of 10. That's pretty good. I'm trying to remember where the last honeycomb is. It might... Oh, you know what? I probably know where it is. Probably. Alright, well, we've got ourselves the, uh, the, the wall maze over here. The wall maze is here to say hello. There's notes involved and everybody is sad. I mean, I, I wouldn't be that sad, but you gotta be kind of quick because um, obviously you're on a time limit. You can grab a new pair of shoes and it'll reset the timer. Each pair of shoes kind of has its own timer though. It's not really obvious what that amount of time is. Admittedly, I find that a bit weird, I guess, but it is what it is. Anyway, I'm gonna wanna go ahead and get over here. This is honestly one of the harder jiggies in the level. Uh, it's kind of a thing, because uh, you see, it's another time challenge, but this time you got 10 seconds and I fell off immediately. I'm really good at this. I may want to go ahead and... This isn't going to last me very long, it turns out. Oh no! First you see it, now you don't! Well... I ran out of wings and things, and I'm sad. But I think I, I saved myself from maybe one point of damage. Probably. This is kind of the problem, is like, failing that one is a bit of a thing, considering getting back takes a bit. Oops. I didn't, I didn't not want to. 
I think the other problem too is like you get this weird camera angle, which just isn't helpful in all honesty. It's just, it's not. It's the, the least helpful thing. Jump for it and you win. It's all that's important is that you you get it. You know, it's not a it's not a big deal if you fall afterwards. Cause I mean, I obviously I already got the prize. So what else is there to do but cry? There's a mumbo token trying to be sneaky behind Mumbo's hut. Let's go ahead and shrink in size to suit my mood. Let's go back here, grab this. All right, Mumbo, in this level. In case you were wondering, he does exist. Um, so let's, let's go say hello. Mumbo, in this level, wants you to have 10 tokens. I don't know if we're gonna have enough. It's a mystery, ah, okay. I was gonna say, I know one of these houses has a thing of importance in it. I mean, I know there's more than one, actually, but just jump for it. It's, it's a thing. Sup, Mumbo? Do your magic! Yeah! Am alligator now. Aw, uh, wait. Mumbo need new boots! You don't even wear shoes. What would you need boots for? You monster! How dare you? even suggest such a thing. So, alligator form. Unlike the termite, I actually do have a, an attack in the form of a weird little bite. Uh, also, I am immune to piranhas, as the mighty alligator does not care. Uh, unfortunately, mighty alligator isn't particularly fast. I didn't know if there was anything over here, because I couldn't tell because draw distance was a bit of a thing. Anyway... Now that I'm an alligator, there's a few things I can do. I'm gonna go ahead, actually, and, uh... I want to find the rest of the notes before I get too far here. Uh, cause you see, now that I'm an alligator, I can fit in the nose there. I don't wanna go in there just yet, though. It doesn't seem like a good time. It doesn't, doesn't seem like a good time. All right. Over here, there's a lot of stuff to gain over here. I'm at what, 90 notes, I think? I think I'm at 90. Um, but yeah, there's a bunch of collectibles to get around these parts. There's some notes over here. There's a Jinjo. It was the last Jinjo. Yo, I did it. I got all of the Jinjos in the world. I keep trying to change the camera and it just never works out. It just, it just doesn't. I was gonna say, there's usually like two of these, but for some reason I wasn't finding the other one. I mean, I, I know I found it, but I didn't, I didn't get it. All right, are there any more notes around here? This is a good camera. I mean, it works. The water is actually very clear underneath, turns out. I don't know why, but you know, I don't know. I know there's notes in the alligator, but I don't know how many. Um, I guess I'll go in and take a look. By virtue of, uh, I don't know where else notes might be. I feel like I was fairly thorough. So, uh, we'll just, we'll just go in and hope that there's six in here. That's all I wanted to know. There might be six. Yeah, I think there's six, because there's three in each side. Each nostril. There we go, I did it. I found all the notes in the world. All right, so I don't have to worry about note score anymore. This isn't too bad, but it's still kind of a thing. <laughs> I'm Mr. Vile, greediest crock of all. Play my game to win a prize. I'll press A. Game is simple, you gotta eat the yumblies. Yo, do you know about the yumblies? This game is a bit unfair. Uh, you gotta actually use the attack button to, to bite these guys. Dude, kind of, well, I, he doesn't really rubber band, but he's pretty good at predicting where these things are. Your best bet, honestly, is to try to stay ahead of him, but that's a little bit difficult to do. 
sometimes. Mostly because he seems to just know where they are. It's a, a bit of a rude thing, honestly. Honestly, the game lasts a bit longer than I would like, but it is what it is. Yeah, because if you can just prevent him from eating any, then you're generally pretty good. It's just unfortunate. Like, if you miss, then you get stuck in your biting animation for a while, and it's kind of unfortunate. But, uh, I mean, this first round isn't too terribly difficult. Um, a lot of it does come down to some amount of luck, unfortunately. Yo, I win pretty handily. Ah, yes, I, I won the easy game. Now we play the harder game. Eat the reds, avoid the yellows. They not ripe. They don't actually hurt you, but you will get stunned. So uh, do not eat the yellows. They are a bad day. There's a whole lot of these guys over here for some reason. Uh, whoops. I have gone in the wrong direction. No, that one's mine. You can't have it. It's mine. My yumbly. I'm eating all the yumblies in the world. They are mine and not yours. I think he does go a little bit faster sometimes out of nowhere. It's a little bit weird. I just kind of sniped that one from you somehow. I don't know how that happened, but uh, you know what? It's all right. I am not going to complain. Uh, if you wanted to and were having trouble with this game, as many did as a kid, um, I'm actually losing ground here pretty quickly. You can come back and do this later in the game, and it should be easier for reasons that have to do with some uh, elephants that are walking around in a circle in this room. Don't worry about the elephants. Lucky Greeny wins! We gotta play a last game because rule of threes. Uh, this time we have to show what's... We have to eat what's at the top of the screen so it'll shift from red to yellow. Uh, you gotta be careful because sometimes it might shift while you're mid-bite. Uh, it's a bit of a problem. Um, Please switch, thank you. All right, now I can go ahead and eat the yellows. Eating the yellows. Yeah, this one is actually a bit of a tricky thing. Um, yeah, I was gonna say, I think it's about to switch, so I'm hoping. Why are there so many yellows when I need to eat the reds? Why are there so many yellows? Now all the yellows are gone. Get, that's mine, you can't have that. There's more over there. I'm a little upset, actually. I, the prospect of this, I was going to say, it's, it's going to shift. It kind of shifts at regular intervals, so you got to be a little bit prepared. Um, now it's yellow, there's lots of them over here. I'll go up here and grab that one before he has a chance. Um, I think I win at this point. Oh, I wanted to eat a last second red. No fair. Mr. Vile never lost before, and he can have prize. Yeah, sure can. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, grab this feather, though. Don't worry about that elephant there. It's not important. I got myself a jigsaw. Oh, yeah. I think, actually, can I interact with you? A tougher challenge if Greeny not scared. You must win next three games to win three extra lives. But each time Greeny loses, Mr. Vile chomps you for one life. Yeah, so, um... Yeah, you know what? No. <laughs> you're, you're... Listen, lives aren't worth it here, you know? Oh no, I am running away because your game has bad prizes. I feel so awful and embarrassed. Yeah, no, if you lose the normal game, he does chase after you and he will bite you for like one bit of damage. If you're quick enough, you can run away. Um, I'm having a bit of a problem here because I, I want to leave as a crocodile, but I think if I do that, Croctus Man is gonna respawn at his initial position, which isn't too bad. I think it's worth it because then I don't have to worry about going back to transforming again through the wall maze. Like, I, I lose nothing but a little bit of time by doing this. All right, so remember last time how I broke that ice cube? 
Uh, now I want to go back over here as an alamigator because I I'm able to do something I previously was unable to do. Yeah. Let's go ahead and uh, slide around on the ice real quick. Go on up this hill. Get ourselves another golden feather. There's a nice little gap over here that only a small creature can fit through. Wow. Nice. What's over here? <gasps> Mystical magic book? Cheeto the spell book? Magic cheats. Hey, book brain! Does this book have a brain? I, I, I'm not sure about this. I mean, cause like, you have eyes, but does that mean you have a brain? I don't think that's how that works. Come on, book boy, give us a spell! Only one spell. Enter the code Blue Eggs on Sandcastle Floor in Treasure Trove Cove. Help you, it will. Thanks, Mr. Cheeto! Hidden in Lair, other spellbooks. Even though they're implied to be all you, it's just, you know. Stop watching me play! Yeah, well, you know, I have that problem a lot, too. It, it's rather tragic, but seriously. No one's allowed to watch me play video games. If you're watching me play video games... Watch out, because the police are on to you, I'm sure. Anyway, I'm gonna cut the video, because, uh... I gotta go back to being a bear and a bird, but also to getting... that last jiggy that I just kind of ignored. Don't worry about it. I'll see you in a little bit. Wow, extremely rude. How dare you? Yep, he sure did respawn. Well, that's fine. Get out of here, you stupid. No one invited you. I did it. I fed all of the practices. It was the thing that I needed to do. Yeah. Let's do or dance. All right, now we can, now we can leave. <laughs> Apparently it also reset you having numb feet. That's weird. But yeah, we, we can just, we can go now. All right, now that's all done, it is time to leave. And, uh, well, we already opened up the next world, but we don't really know where it is now, do we? It's unfortunate. I guess next time, uh... We've got some weird camera angles here. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna figure out where to go next. I'll see you later and goodbye!